Hi, hey, everybody. Matthew. It's uh, Krista Burgess and Miji. Uh, we're in Cambridge right now. This is our first video blog update of the year. And just want to share a little bit about what we have been doing and what's been going on here in Cambridge. I just got back from a teaching trip, getting to teach the Gospel of John to a nearby YOM base. Mm -hmm. uh, I taught in the School of Biblical Studies there, which is the school that we're running here in Cambridge. Mm -hmm. And it was a phenomenal teaching, absolutely amazing. I've been going through the Gospel of John for the past three months about. Mm -hmm. And some of the things that have been really sticking out to me and connecting with me is the fact that this is, for me, the first time I've got to teach a Gospel in the SBS. And it was just such a amazing experience getting to go through and really dig into a Gospel uh, to this degree this time. It was... Um, just profound. And John specifically had so much weight for me because over the past few years I've been spending so much time in the Old Testament. Mm -hmm. uh, reading and studying and teaching. A lot of my favorite teachings have been out of the New Testament or Old Testament recently. And it has just uh, grown uh, to such depth in my heart, really. Mm -hmm. And then digging into John, John basically retells the Exodus story through the life of Jesus <clears throat> and connects his life through the Exodus and mm -hmm. Uh, to so many Old Testament narratives and all this stuff uh, throughout the Old Testament pointing to the fact that Jesus is better and Jesus is the truer picture of these things. And so all of that stuff connecting for me, for example, the water to wine, uh, replicating the uh, Nile turning to blood, except now it's a blessing instead of a curse. Mm -hmm. uh, Jesus uh, is sought by man in the garden instead of God seeking man, just like in Genesis. Right. The uh, man who is healed at the pool of Bethesda was there for 38 years. Just like uh, in the wilderness wanderings, the Israelites were in the wilderness for 38 years, and they were about to go into the promised land, just like this man gets healed and enters into the promises of God. You know, the, wow. All of these things just connect so much through the Old Testament. That's just a, a tiny taste of everything in John. So it was such an amazing experience. I get to teach it again in May here for the Cambridge School of Biblical Studies. And that is, yeah, I'm teaching Jeremiah next week, and so I'm preparing a lot for that. And then I've got Zechariah and Matthew this quarter as well to teach. And, yeah, we've just been doing a lot. So I'll let Miji share a little bit about what she's been learning and what we've been doing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've been, uh, we just at the school finished the Book of Isaiah, and uh, it was just amazing to see all this connection, Messianic prophecy and how Isaiah prophesies uh, about this coming servant, the coming son uh, that will save the entire nation. And just to see God's heart, to see his people, to be his holy nation, to be representative to all the nation, to be a light. But the Israel just kept fail and fail, failing and failing. And so he, um, you know, has this plan from the beginning to send Jesus Christ. And then he is a perfect sacrifice to to all people to come together to worship him. So it was just a amazing picture to see, um, yeah, Jesus, more of his life and his missions uh, through the book of Isaiah. So it was uh, very, um, yeah, deep and a lot of a lot of uh, studying, but it was really good. And today we, uh, as part of my, yeah, our <laughs> application, and we got to talk to this homeless guy just to deliver you know, Jesus is love, and it was just, yeah, awesome mm -hmm. to do that, and so that's what we do here. <laughs> yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, it's, uh, we've just been having such a wonderful time connecting in the community here, and uh, yeah, getting to minister both to people just walking on the street, as well as the homeless here, and so we've been so blessed mm -hmm. to have those opportunities during this SBS, mm -hmm. and uh, right now, we uh, are just full back drive into this school and in training these students, we're getting prepared a little bit to send them on outreach in the summertime uh, to a number of different countries uh, to bring teams from college of college students from the UK uh, out to places like Greece and Japan and uh, Nepal, potentially China also, uh, possibly. And yeah, we're getting prepared for those uh, teams to go out also. Uh, at this time, uh, Miji is still in need of a couple thousand dollars for her school fees for to finish out the school. Mm -hmm. And so if you would uh, feel like you'd like to give towards that, then there are a few links on our blog uh, you can follow or contact us and we can uh, direct you with that. 
uh, as well. I've had a few people ask me over the past few months and, uh, mm -hmm. yeah, past six months or so about my teachings and listening to them online or listening to recordings and things like that. And I have recently uh, got my teachings of John. Uh, each one of them is about two hours and a half. And so all of those are linked on a page on our blog that is right under our heading picture. It's called mm -hmm. Christer's Teachings. And my three sessions of John are up there. Mm -hmm. You can listen to each one of them uh, and learn, hear about everything I had to say about John, which I just gave you a taste in this mm -hmm. blog. Uh, I will be continuing to upload my teachings so that people can listen to them as I receive them on MP3s. So mm -hmm. I keep an eye out for those, and I'll give an update as when those come out uh, and when I post those. So uh, everybody be blessed. Thank you so much for watching, and uh, Happy New Happy Year. Happy New Year. Oh. All right, bye-bye. <laughs>